spray gun, people! Man, that's some spray and pray. How the hell do we get at least these cops shooting this poor guy? Okay, so uh, <laughs> that noise you heard was the dog crying. He's locked in the car like, I want to get out and do something, Dad. <laughs> Did y'all hear that? <laughs> First time I heard that, I was like, what the? I was like, oh, it's a dog crying to get out in the action. All right, how do we get here? Okay, so the pursuit starts with this guy. Mom called the police because he got in an argument, took the car, maybe heard a gunshot. And they kill him. Shocking. So I heard a little pop. I don't know who he's shooting at or how he's shooting when he's driving, but evidently the cops are saying he shot at him. Shots fired! Shots fired, Lake! Shots fired! Shot fired. He shot fired. Shot at me again at 25 mile an hour. How fast are these guys going? Shots fired. I get it, but still. Endangering. Are they really helping? Cemetery. We're still southbound coming up towards downtown Mount Dora. It's a white male, look like a black handgun. Why has it got to be a black handgun? Sounds a little racist. Copy, shot fired. Oh, he ran into a wall. I wonder how that happened. Handgun. So what happened is his brakes got hot. He tried to take this corner going really fast. You get kind of like, you. sometimes you lose perception of how fast you're going and how much time you need to stop. And then your brakes heat up. And you think you can stop, and you can't, and you end up having what's called understeer. Uh, and he went straight, one at a time. and he hit the wall. Copy, shot fired. He didn't hit the wall. He almost created a new garage door for that building. So one cop hit another cop right here. Copy, shot fired. If this cop was getting out of his car, he would have been run over. Did this? Did this cop? Pull in front of this car, or did this cop go too fast and hit the sky? Bam. Bam. Rammed him, even though he's stuck in a wall. Was that ram intentional, or was that because I couldn't stop? I'm going to go with he couldn't stop. His brakes were hot, and he couldn't stop. There's really no reason to ram a guy when it's half the car stuck in there. Maybe park behind it so he can't get out, but to ram in the side... Supposedly, if a guy's shooting at you, is this cop scared? He's going to pull right into the guy that's supposedly shooting at the cops and put himself in the driver right in a position. I mean, we always heard about officer safety, officer safety, except when they don't care about it or when they make a mistake or what? Please say a command. Okay, so now he's backing up. And they open up. Okay, so I... Probably close to 20 rounds here. This looks like an undercover car that pulled in, stopped, got out. This cop gets a little too close. You see him run backwards in a minute. Here he goes running backwards. I don't know if the suspect's shooting at him or if this cop is shooting at him, but he's come bailing back here. Try saying the device name like or your speed. Main menu. Main menu. What, what's what's talking in there? I wonder if the dog's hitting a computer keypad. Dog's trying to call in for cover and shit. He's like, yo, my dad needs cover. He locked me in a car. Crash, he's, he's out on the ground. He's out on the ground. Hands on his head. Hold it. That looked like it might have been a chopper doing a flyby. You're going to see a shadow come by here. I'm pretty sure this is probably a chopper. Oh God, was that a woman coming in way in the end? <laughs> it's either a guy who identifies a woman or it's ponytail police. I'm going to stay way back here, but I'll have my gun out. <laughs> wow. Wow. Who 
thinks he was aiming those shots? Or just kind of like shooting in a general direction? I like his rip. He doesn't try to use a slide release. Rick, that's, that's false. You Train, big, large muscle movements. He grabs that slide, rips it back, lets it go. That's a good reload, in my opinion. He's already went through one magazine, going through another one. All those surrounds fired guy still can open the door. Reloading again. How many rounds he got in there? That's got to be... It looks like a double stack. I mean, that's, I'm guessing 12 to 15. And it's a 9 mil, maybe even 18, 20. Four, single four. Oops. Yo, dude, you just pulled in front of me. Okay, so I, maybe I didn't see this. Let's see this guy pulls in front of me. Four, single four. Oh, he did pull in front of him. That was his fault. Bam. Bam. Oh, guy did pull a gun right here and pointed right at him. That's what you get for pulling in on somebody. Like, this is why you don't... People always say, why didn't they ram him? This is why. Because you're going to run into this. This cop's freaking lucky. I mean, why would you put yourself... Cops are always screaming, now officer safety. Why would you put yourself in harm's way like this? Man, he's, he's opening too. He's in the fight. Bad crossfire right here. This guy is shooting at him, getting out of the car. Remember when that other cop took off running? Was he running from these bullets, or was he running from the suspect bullet? Hard to tell when you surround the car. Shit shooting through the windshield. I don't know who freaking is teaching this shit, but it's just so stupid. <laughs> I mean, pistols don't have that much velocity and that much power anyway, and then you put them through a windshield, you're losing velocity, even if you hit the guy. Now you got to go through your windshield, through his side window, through his car, into him, and you wonder why none of your bullets are effective. Not to mention glass, blow black, uh, b blowback, uh, smoke in the car. I mean, just such a shitty way to do it. I mean, but whatever. I mean, he's there. What else is he going to do? I mean, he could have rolled out and ran to the back of the car. I, I don't know if that would have probably would have been better, but at least he stayed in the fight, I guess. Pretty quick reload. these cops do if they have revolvers and only have five or six rounds what the hell i mean cops now it's just like eh, we carry around a thousand rounds pretty soon cops will be able to carry around you know 50 round mags so they can just so they don't have to reload quite as much and they can just spray and pray 50 rounds stop, stop, stop. all right so i don't know good shootout bad shootout the guy shot at him he was obviously in a fight um, I mean, hey, at least they had meteor cops there, except for that ponytail police that came in afterwards, uh, who were engaging the threat and took him out. Was this guy a threat to anybody other than his family when he left? I don't know. So I wanted to add this in, that he was actually a threat. I don't know if they knew this, but it sounds like this 18-year-old killed his dad because they found the body, which was identified as the father of the guy in the shooting. So Johnny was the shooter, and, uh... Looks like they found him. What else do they say in here? Missing. Detective started tracking. 18-year-old killed his father and dumped the body. Uh, that's why he was... I don't know why he... Uh, what went on and why he killed him. Initially responded to the home when a woman called and reported she had been on the phone with her husband, Juan, and heard him arguing with their son. So mom heard him arguing and heard a gunshot. And evidently they just found a body like two days later. I can't, I can't believe it took them two days to find this. That's kind of crazy. Uh, 
Loud noise disconnected. They responded. The investigator is searching for the white truck. Uh, oh, a helicopter spotted Johnny. So that was a helicopter that I thought I saw was the shadow. Uh, when attempts pull over, uh, shooting, return fire. Eh, I guess you can read all that if you want to. I'll pause it and let you go down. She had a nervous breakdown. Johnny's charged with attempted murder, law enforcement. Oh, so I guess Johnny didn't die. They fired freaking over a hundred rounds at this dude and he didn't die. Man, it's just crazy. The way cops have no accountability for their rounds whatsoever. And they can just shoot with impunity and nobody cares. I don't even know if the car was stolen, but whatever. Well, then that there.